propagation and stuff like that. And I feel like that was the coolest thing in the world because it's such an obvious issue, but nobody, it's like a huge beast that nobody really has the correct tool right. to really come against it because it seems like it, you're coming against the culture, you're coming against the rapper themselves or the brand themselves. And it's like, no, I'm coming against the issue. Um, so I wanted just to, everybody who's watching right now, um, just to let them know who you are, what you do, um, kind of introduce them to you. Right on. Thank you very much uh, for allowing me the platform. Um, yeah, course. so I started, um, I guess it would have been two or three years ago, I started working with um, Lance Cooper uh, with 804 Street Media. He's uh, he's based in Richmond, Virginia. Okay. Um, or, yeah, Richmond, Virginia. And he does a whole lot of work with hip hop. Um, and we connected because um, there was this issue with Kevin Gates. He had just um, assaulted, I think, a fan. Oh, yeah. And um, it was just crazy because there, he wasn't being held accountable at all for <laughs> anything that happened to the girl. Right. And um, I reached out to Lance. I saw what he was doing, and he said, hey, you know, will you help me delete this petition, you know, to get him banned from hip hop? And um, it, it actually worked. Uh, we, you know, we, he started the petition. I helped to further circulate it. And um, went, or, um, Kevin Gates was actually banned from pre performing uh, in Florida for, um, I think it was like a good six months. Mm -hmm. And 